Welcome to Rosemary Radar, where I tell you all the things you should be looking forward to in the upcoming week. On Monday, May 16th, Fall Guys is teasing a big, 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 big announcement. And one would assume that this means that they are finally announcing the release dates for the Xbox and Nintendo Switch versions of the game. As you may remember, this game launched as a PlayStation exclusive and it has been since. Maybe they'll shadow drop it. Maybe it'll be available that same day. Maybe you won't even have to pay for it if you have Xbox, if you already have Game Pass. It's just going to be there included. Who knows? But it's exciting to see some new life in this game because it's such a good time. On Tuesday, May 17th, WWE 2K22 will release its Most Wanted pack with new wrestlers like Cactus Jack, Boogeyman, Vader, and more. Also on that day is the 505 Games Showcase, and they've got a lot of great titles under their banner like Control, Dead by Daylight, Human Fall Flat, No Man's Sky, so hopefully we'll get some cool announcements there. Nothing big coming out Wednesday, but on Thursday, May 19th, The G Word with Adam Canover will land on Netflix. This is Adam from Adam Ruins Everything, and in this series, he's tackling the U.S government in the good and the bad and it's executive produced by Barack Obama then on Friday May 20th a big day for Netflix is Jackass 4.5 will hit there featuring additional stunts and skits not seen in Jackass forever there will also be a brand new season of Love Death and Robots as well as new episodes of My Guest Needs No Introduction with David Letterman over on Disney Plus we are getting the wonderful looking new film Chip and Dale Rescue Rangers and on HBO Max we're getting a documentary about George Carlin directed by Judd Apatow called George Carlin's American Dream and then for music releases, nothing that's going to top Kendrick Lamar's incredible new album, obviously. Not much can, except Frank Ocean. But we are getting new records from Porridge Radio, Lecky Lee, and an album that definitely, absolutely did not leak weeks ago. It did not leak. Nobody downloaded it. Uh, everybody will be hearing this album for the very first time on Friday. It's Harry's House from none other than Harry Styles. That's it for this week, guys. It's May and the sun's already too hot, so let's work on that whole global warming thing. Uh, abortion is healthcare. F*** that monster from Buffalo. Drink water. Follow us. Goodbye.